Hi there, welcome to WP Expo. Today, I will show you how we can create a custom My Account Page template for WooCommerce, and it will replace the default My Account Page of your online store. For that, I will be using the WooCommerce Builder add-on of Product X. It is the best WooCommerce builder based on Gutenberg, so that you can dynamically redesign all pages of your WooCommerce store without compromising the loading time. So without further ado, let's start creating a custom My Account Page template. But before going into that, make sure you have the ProductX plugin installed on your site. After properly installing the ProductX plugin, go to the add-on section and make sure that the WooCommerce Builder add-on is turned on. Now go to the Builder section. Here, you can see all available options. For now, let's click on My Account. Here you can see two options. Either we can start from scratch or start with any of the available pre-made templates. First of all, I will start with a pre-made template. Later, I will also show the process of starting from scratch. So, please watch the full video for a better understanding. To start using the pre-made template, we need to click on the import button. Here you can see that the template is imported to the page. It is displaying dummy information and will be replaced with the actual details when you visit the actual My Account page. Now, as you can see, it's a pre-made My Account page, so you can publish it as it is, or you can also customize it according to your requirements. First of all, you can change the layout between vertical and horizontal. Then you can disable or enable the profile. Once you enable it, click on the drop-down to see the available customization options. Here you can change the typography and text color. Moreover, you can also adjust image width, height, border radius, and spacing. In the Navigation tab, you can change the typography and adjust the width and spacing. Furthermore, you can choose your desired text and background colors. Similarly, you will have full customization options for tab content, form, and table order. When you are done with customization, just click on the Publish button. And that's all. Your custom My Account page is ready. Now, let's see how it looks at the front end. Here, you can see that the new custom My Account page has been replaced with the default one. Now, what if you want to create a My Account page from scratch? For that, click on the Start from Scratch option instead of importing a template. Now, drag and drop My Account block. Customize it as per your need to achieve the desired outlook. So that's all from today's video. You can learn more about creating and customization the WooCommerce My Account page template from the blog post. The link will be in the description. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.